Hi cellos, today we're going to work on Old Joe Clark. We're gonna do the second line, which is the second system top line. Okay, so remember a system is two lines of music or more connected by a bracket, all right? So we're gonna look at the second one of that, second set of lines, the top of that, okay? Starts with two half note A's. It sounds, this is what the whole so line sounds like. <laughs> of that line have that A, C sharp, B, G, A, A that we had in our first top line of Old Joe Clark, okay? So if you remember that from my other video, then great, you're already ahead. We'll go over it first quickly right now so that it's super easy when we get to it later in the line, okay? Because this is really the hardest part of the line and we like to start with the hard parts first, right? Because then everything's easy after that. So. Start with A, C sharp, and remember C sharp, you gotta leap up to that extended fourth finger, okay? So remember, the C sharp goes between your third tape, and you might have a dot or a tape up here, not sure, okay? But it's gonna go right in between those, all right? So past your third tape, all right? And when your fourth finger is on that C sharp, that extended C sharp, okay, that's past your third tape. When your fourth finger is on there, your second finger should be on your second tape, okay? So normally, your third finger would be there, right, for that B. But right now, when you're in the extended position, your second finger will be there, okay? So just try A, C sharp, ready, go. A, C sharp, awesome, stay there. Remember I just said your second finger will be on B because it's in the extended position. So you're going to go second finger B, B, G. So try B, G, good. So now try A, C sharp, ready, go. A, C sharp, now B, G, ready, go. B, G, nice. Now go A, C sharp, B. So right now we're only doing one little shift from A up to extended C sharp. From there, our second finger's on that B. We don't have to move for that B. That's where our second finger is. So right now, A, C sharp, B, open G, all right? So during that open G, we're gonna move our hand back so we can do A, A, all right? So two tiny little shifts. But the second one's super easy because we do it during our open G. Okay, so try that. A, C sharp, B, G, move back. A, A, try it again. Ready, go. A, little shift, C sharp, B, G, move your hand back. A, A. Awesome. If you have to do that a few more times to really get it, I recommend you pause this video right now. Work on it until you feel good about it so that later on when we get back to it, you're going to feel super good. It's going to feel really easy, okay? Right now, if you feel good about it, we're going to go back to the beginning of that line, okay? Ready? First two measures sound like this. A, A, B, D, C sharp. And remember that C sharp, we got to leap up to that extended C sharp. Luckily, we have a D, an open D before it, so while we're playing the open string, we're leaping up with our hand, okay? So try A, A, B, D, C sharp, okay? And you gotta listen to make sure that C sharp's in tune, because I'm not there to tell you if it's in tune or not, so really listen to mine and make sure it matches yours. All right, remember, A is 100 G string. Ready, try it, here we go. A, A, B, D, leap up, C sharp. Nice, next part's really easy. It's just A, A, third finger B, B, B. We're in our normal first position, so B is a third finger this time. So try A, A. Two 
measures are just like the first two measures. We can do them together. Ready, go. A, 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 D, leap up, C sharp. Nice. And now we're to that A, C, B, G, A, A. Let's try it together. Ready, go. A, C sharp, B, G, A, A. Nice job, friends. Let's go from the very beginning of that line and do the entire line the whole way through. We can do this, cellos. Ready, beginning. Here you go. A, A, E, D, C sharp, A, A, B, B, A, A, E, D, leap up, C sharp, back to A, A, C sharp, B, G, A, A. All right, you did it. Good job, cellos. Thank you for practicing today. Have a great day. Goodbye.